Phil loved to speed around the nursing home in her wheelchair, taking corners on one wheel and getting up to maximum speed on the long corridors. Because the poor woman was one sandwich short of picnic, the other residents tolerated her, and some of the males actually joined in. One day, Ethel was speeding up one corridor when a door opened and Matt Nicky stepped out with his arm outstretched. Stop! He shouted in a firm voice. Have you got a license for that thing? Ethel fished around in her handbag and pulled out a Kit Kat wrapper, then held it up to him. Okay, he said, and away Ethel sped down the hall. As she took the corner near the TV lounge on one wheel, Weird Harold popped out in front of her and shouted, Stop! Have you got proof of insurance? Ethel dug into her handbag, pulled out a drink coaster and held it up to him. Harold nodded and said, Carry on, ma'am. As Ethel neared the final corridor before the front door, Crazy Craig stepped out in front of her, stark naked, holding a very sizable erection in his hand. Oh, good grief, said Ethel. Not the breathalyzer again. <laughs> so Johnny is taking a shower with his mother and says, Mom, what are those things on your chest? Unsure of how to reply, she tells Johnny to ask his dad at breakfast tomorrow. Quite certain the matter would be forgotten by little Johnny. But Johnny didn't forget. The following morning, he asked his father the same question. His father, always quick with the answers, says, Why, Johnny, those are balloons. When your mommy dies, we can blow them up and she'll float to heaven. Johnny thinks that's neat and asks no more questions. A few weeks later, Johnny's dad comes home from work a few hours early. Johnny runs out to the door crying hysterically. Daddy, Daddy, mommy is dying. His father says, Calm down, son. Why do you think mommy's dying? Uncle Harry is blowing up mommy's balloons and she's screaming, Oh God, I'm coming. 